Jackie Lee and I am the new Extension Entomologist in Insect Pest Management for Fruit and Pecans at Oklahoma State University. Today I'd like to talk to you about dormant oil application. Dormant oils are one of the most important insect management tools that we can use um, to control overwintering insect populations in our trees and our shrubs. Now dormant oils are refined petroleum products that are formulated um, to spray onto shrubs and trees. Dormant actually refers to the timing that these are applied. You want to apply them um, before new growth occurs, so before bud break, but you want to make sure that the plant has gone dormant. So late winter to early spring is really good timing for a dor dormant oil application. You want to make sure and not apply dormant oils too early or you can get winter damage. You also do not want to apply dormant oils um, to new growth because they can sustain some injury. If you apply dormant oils when the um, temperatures are too high, the oil will not go into solution correctly and you will not get enough coverage on the trees um, to coat them and control the insects. There are um, three main types of insects that are controlled with dormant oils. Those are scale insects, mites, and aphids. Dormant oils will coat the insect and block the spiracles. And spiracles are little openings on the insect abdomen that it uses to breathe. So when you block the spiracles, you essentially smother the insect. Now this controls the overwintering populations so that in the springtime, you have less population of that insect building. So it really gives you a great jump start into spring um, for your trees and shrubs, especially for your insect management program. You want to make sure and make dormant oil applications on your fruit trees like apples, pears, crab apples, also pecan trees. Dormant oils are very good for certain trees and shrubs. Peaches, nectarines, and apricots rarely require a dormant oil spray, but if you have had a pest problem in the past, it's okay to go ahead and spray them. Dormant oils can also be used on woody ornamentals and shrubs. Euonymus is a type of ornamental plant that is susceptible to scale, and I would recommend spraying a dormant oil um, in late winter and um, early spring. There are some precautions when using dormant oils. You want to make sure to make your applications during the right time, so late winter, early spring. Avoid the temperature extremes, so do not apply during freezing temperatures, and do not apply in for temperatures over 70 degrees. Also, um, there are many woody ornamental plants that can be damaged by dormant oil applications. These are listed on the label, so make sure and review that list on the label. Also, there's many annual flowers that can be damaged by dormant oil sprays. When you make your applications, make sure that there are no um, annual plants nearby that could be damaged. Another thing to consider is if you make an application of a sulfur-containing pesticide, you do not want to make this at the same time as a dormant oil application. You want to time those at least three to five days apart. An example of that is captan. There are many benefits to using dormant oils. Dormant oils are fairly inexpensive. They're also readily available at any home gardening store. So dormant oils are less toxic to beneficial insects such as ladybugs. They also have very low toxicity to birds and mammals. So if you use dormant oils, you will decrease the overwintering population of insects in your gardens. This will actually save you time, energy, and money when you head into spring.